Hello, hello, can you hear me? That says I'm live. That little email I just got. I should close that. I should close that. How are y'all doing, everybody? Quit that. Quit that. The rest can stay, maybe. Hi, Mariah. Let me know what you want to hear, sister. Sorry you've been feeling bad. We got some people up here from the YouTube coming up. Sorry, I should have quit all these programs on my computer before before I got here. There I am. I've been working hard, y'all. I've been working hard. Um, we had softball practice today. I know that y'all are really wondering how softball is going. Um, it's going really good. It's going really good. We have some really good uh, little learners. And they uh, have actually got some good pictures. Don't tell, don't tell the surrounding communities, but we've got a few secret weapons. Yes, I am coming to Mile Zero Fest. I saw, you know, we have a we have a one screen movie theater in Hondo, and they are playing that Godzilla business right now. And I saw, I drove by it today, and it says Godzilla versus Kong, and I was like, man, they're doing the rerun thing, huh? I thought that Godzilla was, you know, old. But I guess they're remaking everything. They're remaking and continuing everything. So, anyway. I just saw a request for this and I didn't know what I was going to play first. So here you go. If I told you how I really feel about you Would you care too much at all? Would the tension that you're feeling send you reeling or just drive you up a wall? Would you say it's not the time or place? Maybe we could meet another day. If I told you how I really feel about you, well, I wonder what you say. In the dark, I feel a loneliness inside comes creeping into view. And I'd be lying if I didn't say that oftentimes it makes me think of you. And I feel like you're awake somewhere Dealing with a sorrow all your own If I told you how I really feel about you Well, you'd never be alone If I told you how I really feel about you, would you care too much at all? Would you say you had an idea this was coming and you felt it all along?
Would you tell me that you love me too and wish we'd met a lifetime ago? If I told you how I really feel about you, would you wish you didn't know? Thank you, thank you for that request. I got to play some real shows this weekend, y'all. It was it was pretty fun. I went to uh, New Braunfels and played with my old friend Johnny Burke, and we sang a bunch of songs. Uh, we sang a bunch of old songs. And it was so fun. And uh, where is my where is my a heart um johnny is a guy that whenever i was in the gougers a million years ago we used to run around together and uh he was in a band called the dead ringers and i was in a band called the dead Gou or called the gougers and then just like um just like Jason Eady's band and my band used to travel around just to see if we could maybe get some more um, crowd. The Gougers and the Dead Ringers did that too. And uh, it never worked because it always ended up that we had the same fans. So then we would just all show up like in Oklahoma or whatever and the same 10 people would come. <laughs> that would be there if it was just us by ourselves and then we'd have to split all the money. But I did have a great time on Thursday with him. We got to tell a bunch of old stories. It has um, come to the point where any time that, not any time, but a lot of times when people go, tell us your craziest story that ever happened on the road. A lot of times it uh, starts with this one time Johnny Burke did. <laughs> great songwriter and then uh friday i went to austin and played a show at uh, my friend steve stagner runs this little music series over at the westwood country club and i went and played by the pool at the country club uh to like i don't know 40 or 50 people it was really fun and then i went to the woodlands and had a great crowd everybody's getting really excited about live music and so am i pat campbell jones she was there at the dosey -si do it was great my friend brian white played with me Light a candle for the night.